at 11. Tonight, people gather to mourn the deaths of three young members of our community. Thanks for joining us. I'm Denise Valdez. And I'm Brian Loftus. Three-year-old Deja, eight-year-old Levi, and three-year-old Daniel, all killed within two weeks, uh, each of their deaths completely senseless. 8 News Now reporter Darlene Melendez joining us now live from the Healing Garden where the vigil was held earlier tonight. Darlene? Well, Denise and Brian, the Healing Garden is a place our community typically associates with 1 October, but it's also a place where people come to heal. And tonight, dozens of people came here to do just that after those three young lives were taken tragically. A community brought together in sorrow. I, I'm kind of numb, but broken at the same time. Friday night, dozens mourned the loss of three children, three-year-old Deja, eight-year-old Levi, and three-year-old Daniel. All their deaths within days of each other, each cause senseless. Everything was avoidable. All three of these incidences were avoidable. Police say Deja Hunt was reported missing by her mother. After a search, officers found her body hidden in a duffel bag. The suspect, her mother. Daniel Terrio also reported missing. Then police ruled his death a homicide at the hands of his mother and her boyfriend. Levi Etchenique was in the car with his parents when they were hit by a suspected DUI driver. Levi passed away. I know that from here on out, I'll be here to honor them. The vigil organized by family and friends of the Etcheniques to remember the sweet boy who brought light into their worlds. We have to bury my nephew and I still can't even fathom that that's what's going to be happening in the next couple of days. I feel very much for these other two children that lost their lives too soon in the hands of their mother, their guardian, their protector. The ones that's supposed to be watching out for them. And Deja and Daniel, young lives also cut short too soon. I really hope it is a wake-up call. They're precious, they're babies, they're innocent. They didn't do anything wrong to anybody, you know, and they're damaged by people like us. Different items were left here to remember the children, including a baseball dedicated to Levi that says, quote, those we love don't go away. They walk beside us every day. And tonight, people also stressed that it takes a village to raise a child, and they encourage anyone who needs help to reach out. Reporting live, Darlene Melendez, 8 News Now.